awesome. So hi, my name is Susie Jean. Oh, 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 hi, hi, huh, sorry about that, I've never been on TV or anything, so this is a new, new, all new to me. Um, hi, my name is Susie Jean Spitzer, uh, my friends call me Spitz, um, I don't spit though, I'm a lady. <laughs> I'm from Kentucky, originally, and I'm just, I'm real excited to do this, I mean, I don't know that much about art, but... I know I like looking at it, so I mean, if I can give you my expertise, I guess, on how I think it comes across, maybe, uh, maybe we'll agree, maybe we'll disagree. I mean, just don't get mad at me. I'm just not, you know, I'm not trying to offend you people out there, you know. <laughs> Never. I was raised a good girl. I was a good girl, good Christian girl, you know. But uh, yeah, I mean, my, my family, you know, I grew up on a farm. And I uh, did a, a lot of yard work, uh, a lot of yard work, which was terrible. I hated it. It was just so much, you know, like I just wanted to sit out there in the big field and just <gasps> lay down and have peaceful times to myself. And then my daddy would come up and go, Susie Jean, you need to go take the hay to the hay to the hay. And I was like, okay, dad, you know, can't say no to my daddy. So... But I'm real happy to be here in this studio. I mean, there's so many lights on me right now. <laughs> I feel like I'm glowing, like I'm an angel. Do I look like an angel? I have wings? No. No, sorry. That's, that's I'm blaspheming. <laughs> so our first painting that we are going to discuss is American Gothic by Grant Wood. And he painted this American Gothic in 1930. Okay, okay. Um, you know this painting, uh, I'm from Kentucky and I'm from a place where you have those little houses painted a quaint tan color, you know, with a uh, front porch or stoop as we call it. And you know, I'm, uh, this painting really resonated with me the colors, it, such vibrant colors of blue and brown. Uh, actually, maybe vibrant's not the right word. Um, more dull, uh, but I love dull. <laughs> I mean, I'm from the South. <laughs> I love these colors. I mean, I'm from Kentucky where everything is, houses painted brown, you know, people dressed up in their fancy clothes. It's like a dull hue of blue, so. <laughs> I really like this picture. It reminds me of my childhood. And actually the man in the painting kind of looks like my daddy. Uh, and I don't know if that girl is his wife or his daughter. I mean, she looks kind of old, uh, but she could be one of them spinsters. I mean, we have them in Kentucky. <laughs> Let me just tell you, I am not one of them, but we have them. And they just sit there and they twiddle their thumbs and they are sewing their, you know, all day, all day long, that's what they do. And it's real scary, because I don't want to be that person. But anyways, um, back, sorry, back to the painting. Grant Wood, um, I don't know anything else he's painted, uh, but this American Gothic, and let me just tell you, I'm not, I don't like Gothic, like things that are of the goth nature. I was raised Christian, you know, I. When I heard American Gothic, I thought to myself, oh my gosh, I cannot, I mean, I don't know if I can look at this. I thought it was going to be like the devil, and I thought it was going to have people with like blood, blackness, you know, coming out of their souls, and I just can't go there. I just can't go there, but no, it's really not. It's the, the man is holding a pitchfork. It's a little diabolical, but I will, I will let that slide because they are dressed very proper. Uh, the woman herself has an, a high collar, which is very, very, very tasteful. Um, and I, I really do appreciate that. Uh, a lot of girls nowadays go out, you know, I, this, these are my fun clothes. I'm really, you know, I should have dressed a little bit more tasteful for this television <laughs> debut. But, you know, I thought to myself, hey, I'm kind of a who kind of hey kind of spirit. <laughs> so I thought, let me just wear a bright color and see how it goes. But, um... But yeah, the man in the painting, he doesn't have much hair. Like I said, 
does remind me a little bit of my daddy. Um, my dad did not have hair growing up. And, uh, well, when I was growing up, when he was growing up, he might have had hair, but, I mean, who knows? Who knows? Men go bald really quickly sometimes. And that's not a, that's not a bad thing. You know, I dated this boy, and he was only 25, but he had the biggest bald spot. Joe, is he going to see this? Um, who cares? He was a... He was a man floozy. So, you know what, John? This is for you. You had the biggest bald spot I've ever seen. I mean, I could have put a magnifying glass over that spot and burned your whole head off. I'm just saying. But, you know, you know, I really do appreciate Mr. Wood's painting as in the brush strokes because I really don't see any brush strokes and I think that's the sign of a really good painter because when you can't see the brush strokes, did he even really paint it? <laughs> I mean, think about it. Like, here's the paper or the canvas and here's the paintbrush. Did he even touch it? You know, it, he, maybe he's a wizard. Maybe he's, oh, he better not be. A Satan worshiper. If he prayed to the devil to make this painting happen, can you imagine that? The key does have a pitchfork in there. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. I don't know if I can do this anymore. I think Grant Wood is a Satan worshiper. I really, with all my fiber of my being, I believe that this is true. I can. I looked at that for at least five minutes. I'm going, I'm going down. I'm going downtown. Great. My soul. You realize? Upon hiring me to do this for you, sir, that you have taken my soul out of my body and put it in a little box and buried it under the ground. Oh, I'm okay. Just give me a second. Just give me a moment. I'm okay. I'm all right. Well, you know, I think, uh, I think that the next painting I do, if I do, is going to be a little bit better than this one. I mean, the painting itself. This one, it's not, it's not how you say, like, picturesque for a picture. Does that make sense? Like, it's not a beautiful landscape. Like, I love art that's the ocean or big mountains or sunsets or sunrises, you know, like things that are around us that are beautiful, that God gave us, that we take for granted every single day. But when you see them in a painting, you just go, ha, that's beauty. I like those kind of paintings. This one's just two people in a house. I mean, I get, the house looks nice though. I mean, that house, this house in the painting of this Gothic of America um, reminds me of the house I grew up in, actually. And it was the same color. It was like a brown, like tan, like I said, light tan with a white trimming. And uh, we actually did have like a window of the very top. We had an attic. Oh, we used to play hide and seek. And I used to hide up there. My, my two sisters were terrified to go up there. They thought it was haunted. They thought that, uh, you know, the devil was up there and whatnot. And I said, you know what? The devil is in bad people, not in the attic, okay? <laughs> I mean, the devil is in, like, those famous movie stars that have sold their soul. <laughs> They're not in our attic. So, you know, I would hide up there and they would never find me because they would never go up there. So I did end up getting stuck, you know, up there for a quiet some time, you know, I missed dinner a few times, and then my daddy would um, yell at me. <laughs> but it wasn't my fault. I mean, I'm just a child hiding in an attic. I mean, that's not that bad. I could have been out roller skating, like <sighs> something like, I mean, I don't know. You know what I'm saying. But um, no, Mr. Wood, Mr. Wood, you know, maybe with the name like Wood, he likes these dull colors like brown and like light brown because his name is Wood. I mean, did anyone ever think of that? Well, uh, that's it for this time. 
Uh, we did the old American Gothic, God Bless America. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. I'm Susie Jean Spitzer, and I will see you with the next painting. And hey, who knows, you might like it. <laughs>